Hey everyone, welcome back to Essence Awaken on my TikTok. And if you're on my YouTube, welcome back as well. Please like, share, and subscribe. I definitely appreciate it. Um, just a few announcements really fast just to let everyone know. I am still doing the readings for um, 11 11 $11.11, 11 okay? Um, if you're wanting to do a personal reading with me, just click the link in the bio, okay? And when you scroll down, you're going to see 11-11 um, readings. You go ahead and pay, and then you also put in the notes what you are wanting the reading for, okay? Very simple um, and very convenient. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and jump right into it. This is going to be for my earth signs. I'm just going to do um, the signs. So I'm going to do earth and water today, and then tomorrow I'm going to do air and fire, okay? Depending on how I feel. So let me go ahead and jump right into it. Angels and ancestors and spirit guys, give me some information for my earth signs. Give me some information for my earth signs. What are they needing to know and what are they need to know and what is the guidance for my earth signs? Give me some information for my earth signs, please. Give me some information from my person. Okay, so the overall energy is self-love, caution, I mean creation and intention. So that came out horizontal. So that's the overall energy for you all. So something right now for um actually, even though it came out horizontal, I'm feeling like I need to put it upright. So for all of you, um, you are definitely dealing with your self-love. You're starting to understand your understand yourself. Um, I'm hearing also reinvent yourself. So you need to reinvent yourself of who you are. Um, with the messages and dreams, I really feel like you're definitely getting a lot of messages in your dreams about what is going to... Um, I'm hearing for, uh, foretell, like what's going to happen before it even happens. I don't know why I'm hearing foretell, okay? So you're doing a lot of love. You're getting messages in your dreams about someone that you are dealing with. Um, we have um, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius could be a part of your life or not a part of your life anymore. Okay, take it how it resonates for you. They could be sending you messages in your dream. Okay. But there's a lot of things that you're reinventing yourself. Um or your ancestors, your spiritual team is reinventing yourself. We have attraction, Mars, and hot. Yeah, so there is some type of attraction that's going on between you and a person that is a air sign, okay? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. It could be also a fire sign because hot represents, you know, um, the fire as well. But the overall energy is love and intentions, okay? I, mean, I keep hearing reinvent yourself. There could have been some type of past lack and suffering that you were dealing with, but you're not dealing with that anymore, okay? Because you're in the energy of self-love and re reinventing yourself. You're probably getting a lot of rest, you know, or your ancestors are giving or making you, um, you know, get a lot of rest because that's how they're able to speak to you, okay? I'm hearing something about, like, something... Um, so the enemy can't see what's going on, you know? This also could represent you as well that I'm picking up that you're doing a lot of um, out-of-body experiences. You're going to different dimensions in your dream. You're meeting uh, people from your past or people from another plane, okay? Even yourself. But there's going to, with, you know, with, with you having a lot of past lack and suffering that i really feel like you're not in this energy anymore there's a lot of celebration that's coming towards you and for you as well okay because you're going to get a lot of gifts and abundance okay you're going to have a lot of chemistry okay and love as well so that could be one of your things that's coming towards you okay chemistry because probably in the past because this came out in reverse but my spirit is telling me to keep it upright. So like in your past, whoever you were dealing with, they wasn't giving you, it wasn't like any um, chemistry there, but definitely um, they are giving you, you know, the divine chemistry and passion that you're wanting, the, the love that you deserve. Okay, Earth Signs. This is, um, 
you know, you could be, you're definitely walking in, um, in your divine feminine energy. Okay. You're heightening your, your intuition. You're connecting more with your, um, crown chakra. You're getting a lot of, um, I'm hearing something about defin definition work. So you could be, um, working with the elements separation and longing so someone probably around you that you were dealing with is longing for you because you definitely you know separated yourself from them but you just didn't have chemistry with them anymore okay because you want to go after this love this you know this love that's made for you okay you're just not in that energy anymore but you could have you could have children with this person and family is very important or you could be dealing with someone who has children as well and you guys are very committed um, to your children okay this is really good energy for you earth signs taurus capricorn and virgo okay you could also have these in your chart as well okay um, earth in your in your chart we have neptune compassion yeah someone who's going to come towards you you know or who's already there who's showing you compassion you know showing you the good life you know how you're supposed to be treated in love and how you're supposed to be nurtured okay they're going to come in with really good uh, stability and harmony and flow for you okay the energy is going to flow very very nicely for you earth signs okay there won't be any control tactics or anyone trying to control who you are you know no toxicity see here it is right now yeah they're definitely going to come towards you with a lot of action and courage for a new beginning yeah i don't feel like any old energy this could be someone from your past as well who wants to come towards you but you're not gonna you know, they could be trying to come towards you. Take it how it resonates for you, okay, earth signs. But I really feel like this is new energy. That's what I'm feeling and that's what I'm picking up. These are amazing, amazing cards, okay? There's a little bit of past energy, a past person in here. But you definitely left that person because it was a divine intervention that didn't... I'm hearing that this person soaked up your soul. You know what I mean? They wasn't sewing into you. So you had to ret retreat and distance yourself, Okay, you had to take time out and then you started to think and reflect of all the rejection and the locks and the fatigue that they were giving you, you know, and you're just not in that energy. Yep. See, freedom fell right on top of rejection, loss and fatigue right there. Once you freed yourself from them and you retreated and you and you um, went your own way. This is what happened. You had freedom. You have opportunities coming into your into your life. You know, you're more open. You feel free. You feel like you can bask in the sun even more. You don't feel stagnant. Yeah, there was a decision that you had made. Or this person was trying to make a decision about you and you just, you left it. You, you was feeling very, you could have felt very guarded with this person. Not being able to be vulnerable, you know. So you had to put up your guard. Maybe um, this person had a lot of ego, um, ego, and they were like all about money and they were prideful. They wanted things their way, but they want to come in for with apology, you know, for them having a lot of ego and pride. OK, but I really feel like with the unity and transition, you're just not looking to, you know, you, you're going to accept the apology for the way they treated you and I feel like you forgive them, but you're moving on to something better. I really feel like um, this is new love, you know, there could be someone who's already in your midst because they didn't give you any balance. There was no karmic balance with this person who's going to come in and apologize and um, for the way they treated you or signs. There was a lot of faded belief systems. Okay. Give me one more card from this deck for the earth signs, please. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. You could have been dealing with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Yeah, this person could have been very deceptive. They triggered you a lot, you know? They didn't, um, you felt like you didn't have self-worth on a certain level at a certain time. You were questioning your self-worth, your self-worth, and you had some doubts and lack about this person. Because they was they wasn't they wasn't on your same page as you. They didn't understand how spirit works. Okay? So that's all I have for you, Earth Signs, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.